Hi everybody, it's Divine Diva 222. Thank you for joining me in on another message. Um, it is 2.24 p.m. I saw 2.23 before I started the reading, so it could be significant to you. Also 1.11, um, 444. Um, it's March 20 of 2022. Happy birthday to my daughter. It's the first day of spring and I just saw a sunflower. Many of us, the seeds that we have, you know, have um, planted is about to sprout and you are going to see the beautiful, uh, magical way that God's going to give us everything tenfold. Everything we walked away from, everything that uh, we have learned, our lesson, who we've met is a lesson learned. We learn to let go. We learn to forgive. Everything that we um, we did in the right way and send out love to those that were hating us, to those that were wishing us death as well. Um, so I got a download. My God. That's when I knew I was protected. To, I, I always knew that I was protected, but to have angels appear in your dream and just hold you and put you soft, you know, land you softly um, is amazing because I've had dreams of falling off balconies, um, you know, just name it. Uh, these people have done it and it's, it's your own family. It's your aunts, it's your sister, it's your brother, it's your father, it's your mother for some of you. Um, the thing is, I know all the faces. God reveals your faith, the faces, so you know who can't go with you. Um, you do not, reconciling means that you're okay with everything. You're still alive. Um, you're grateful for everything and you forgave them and you don't need to speak to them. You don't need to even tell them. You know, forgiveness is for you. Um, and it's two, two, two on the timer, as I said that. Forgiveness is for you. It's not for the other person. But the thing is, God knows our hearts. So if you just say, oh, I forgive somebody, but you really don't, you're blocking your own blessings. So stop faking the funk and just move forward and, and do the work to healing. It is hard, hard work. My downloads were people from the past um, just showing up and... I don't know, it's like meeting our friends. Like we're gonna be meeting people. Um, some people are surprised because of the of the way that they treated us. We're really kind to them and we might just help them in a way that their mind and their eyes, their mouth is gonna drop, their eyes are gonna be popping out of their heads like this. They know now that you're an angel on earth. You are an angel that is walking on earth. Um, they try to find you and all other people and they can't. They, it's impossible because I don't understand how people could believe in Satan and evil things. But and then as soon as God comes in and starts showing up, you're crazy. Or if you're dancing and you're happy and you don't care what anybody says, you're crazy. To be sane, you got to be sitting there with a serious face and be a serious person. That's bullshit all the way around if you see it. For you to be hopping around and happy, you're immature, you need help, all kinds of stuff. This wor world is backwards. People will go to jail for stealing name brand things, stealing money from people, not worried about the consequences. Like they'll never get caught. Everything that's done in the dark, everything that's done in an evil way, you will pay for it. It's the law. It has to balance. The earth has to balance itself out. So stop thinking you're untouchable because you're not. Back then, everything that you did and you got away with it, it's because it wasn't time. The earth has a specific time. Okay, it's, it's, it's God's timing. This time that we have is all fake. The man that made time is just to control people. When to get to work, what to do, how to eat, when to eat. It's all fake. 
okay? You should eat when you feel hungry. <laughs> and I'm getting some people, you know, in different countries, which I've been there, they, they stop for breakfast, they stop for lunch, they stop for dinner. It's like, it's, it's, it's man-made, all of that stuff. All right, so anyway, I'm getting that they know, guys, they know. Some of them know and they're aware of the plot. Yeah, so my, a kid was laughing in the background. Um, some of them know that you're aware of the plot and then some don't know that you are aware of the plot, okay? This could be that you don't, you're not aware of some of the plots. This could be for you, um, for those that are changing, for those that have moved away from these toxic, evil people that think you owe them your life and owe them your money and owe them your time, Okay. So I'm getting bounty hunter being chased, running away. I'm getting fake profiles, dating, social media, hiding out. I'm getting a lot of gossip here. I'm getting um, that they don't want to tell you the truth because you, if you know their secrets, they think you won't love them. Um, they're coming to an awareness that their own family has been the cause of it. I'm getting a mother and a grandmother. They know that they were poisonous, they were unhealthy, they were toxic, um, and they have toxic family friends, and there's a lot of bad karmic relationships they held on to. Stop forcing a relationship that's not working. Stop forcing people to be with you and buy them stuff to keep them and bribe them. It's all bullshit. So anyway, We've learned how to bless those that perse persecute us, okay? Um, and somebody's on Percocets. Thank you, spirit. Somebody's popping pills and they're addictive as well. Um, we've learned how to bless these people and not curse them because we know that God commands uh, us to love one another. And that's it. And God doesn't hold de debt. So why should we hold debt? to anybody like saying you owe me we don't owe each other nothing but love okay if you're gonna help somebody you're gonna help them from the kindness of your heart stop asking for shit back okay oh my god <laughs> thank you spirit thank you my hands just automatically went like that that's spirit i love them i spoke to them i said give me signs i know it's so hard for them to do this because it takes a lot of energy from them coming from a different dimension, okay? A different realm. And the thing is, look, this was knocked out and fell on my lap. Okay, this is my command to love each other. God is so real, guys. I'm telling you, you are going to feel like you lack nothing. I lack nothing. I don't lack a relationship. I don't lack love. Many of you need to stop calling each other names. Stop calling each other whores and and sluts and all that. Listen, it takes time. Sometimes we go through different relationships, through different paths with people to learn. Stop saying this person had five kids with five different men and stuff like that. Let me tell you something. Kids are a blessing. Point blank. Stop. Whatever the church is saying, whatever your parents are saying, whatever tradition, culture, beliefs are saying, shove it. Your kids are here. They're a miracle, they're blessings, and we need to raise them correctly. And don't be afraid to punish them. Many of you are just letting them go. Just listen to them and letting them go, disrespecting other people, stealing, doing things. There was a 13 year old that got caught driving. <laughs> I don't know if you guys watched the, you know, this, the news, but it just came in my feed. Because these kids are not being taken care of. They're, they're sponges. They absor absorb everything. Okay? If you're materialistic, your kids are going to be materialistic. You have to teach them the importance of life. Not things. Material doesn't... Do, doesn't it's love. I'm telling you. If you can feel the love that God has... Um, and, and, and willing and ready to give you, he's right inside of you. God's inside of you. That good part, that good thought, that, that touching feeling that someone he sent to you that you threw away because they just didn't look like the person that you wanted them to look like or dress like or act like or be like or walk like. 
You guys need to stop. You don't know who's an angel in human form. You just don't know. So it's time for us to stop looking on the outside appearance. It doesn't pay anymore. That's 10, 10 on the clock. Yesterday, I went somewhere and the building that I passed by was 10, 10, 10, 10 Washington Boulevard. Okay, so you could be from Washington. Okay, this could be somebody from DC I'm speaking to. Okay. Um, all right, so let me see okay so they know a new love is coming this the, the cards fell just like it is i do this because it could take less time okay if you believe me you believe me if you don't you don't have to okay this is what fought this is how it fell and this is how i took it asked for the energy i asked what else i let spirit tell me the story i just ask what's today's energy when i tell you these things fell the way it did I just kind of shoved them into a wooden pile because I got some people's energy here. There's a lot of people here. Okay, it was 11-11. And yes, there's a twin flame here. Okay, so uh, let's see. St. Michael the Archangel is stepping down, is here. St. Michael the Archangel is preventing, protecting you from harm. And there's divine intervention. God does not step down for anybody. I'm going to tell you the download that I have, that I that I received, that, that this witch doctor that I picked up yesterday thought he would come and do it again. Okay, so I'm going to tell you something. You don't know who you're messing with. I am not the one to be messed with. I cannot be taken out. That's all I'm going to tell you. Okay? I know it. You know it. People need to trust that. I don't need family around me. I don't need the family support. Um, I don't need to be joined in a clique. I don't need the amount of legion in real life, like 12-12 on the timer. So you all think because I'm by myself that I'm by myself, but I'm not. Okay? 12-22 on the timer. So you all need to shove it because many of you, that are crying, Lord, Lord, to help me. Lord, Lord doesn't doesn't um, hear you because you kept on doing what you're not supposed to do, going and taking the path that you weren't supposed to take. Not only that, you cursed God's name and you were wishing and doing rituals and paying for it for someone to die and their kids and their family. You wanted to see this person suffer. And the thing is you're seeing your own family suffer including yourself okay because you're doing it on innocent people you've always done it innocent people you're spoiled brats and it all boils down to money and thinking you are it you're conceited and stuck up and think you're it because you have these muscles or whatever <laughs> i keep seeing um so i was um there was a movie with ben affleck i can't remember it but it was on hulu I was guided to watch it and I watched it. It was a sick, sick, sick <laughs> couple. Um, it seemed like he knew about the open marriage and she's a cheater and he just didn't care. He was obsessed with her. He was uh, obsessed. Um, I wouldn't say possessive because she did whatever the hell she wanted to. And they had a, a little girl. And uh, so this could be some one scenario where he just kept watching her do whatever. And he kept on doing rituals to get rid of these men. And there was one part in that movie that was touching. She kept testing him because all of her life, the way she acted made men leave her. Um, and these are normal men, <laughs> like men that were like, uh-uh, it's just too much. I can't deal with her anymore. I am dumping her. So she felt she didn't give a hell, hell's rat's ass what she did. She just kept sleeping with the man. But Ben Affleck was like, I'm going to kill for her. Um, he had this obsessive, unnatural way of dealing with, with her, even their kid. Their daughter 
is part of who they are, um, a monster. The little girl knew about the death. She was, um, you know, she just knew things. She she absor uh, absorbs everything that her parents were going on in a, in a, a sneaky way. Um, it goes to show you that your children are who you are. And if you don't change, your children doesn't change. And the generational repeats its cycle. So I, I advise everybody to go watch it. But there was one part in the movie that was very touching when she's like, you do love me. And it was a sick way. But I, there was a little part in it that I understood. It's just that she never, not the part he was killing for her. Because if he didn't do that and he kept staying with her and not giving up on her, that's different. But he was killing the men that she was sleeping with. All of them. And she, there was a touching part where the, she was like, you can come sleep in my room. And she looked at him and she said, I love you. You do love me. Like, in order for her to know, she was so toxic and so evil that whatever he was doing was proof that he loved her. Not because he stayed with her the whole time, but because he was killing for her. Do you understand me? That is some toxic, devilish shit. <laughs> Go watch it. It's on Hulu. You'll see it. Um, it's a new release. Okay, so I'll tell you right now. There's a, a, mother, a baby mother, baby mama that's a prostitute, a call girl here. She has a lot of boys as friends, a lot of buddies. I think she raps with these guys or she sings with these guys. I'm hearing, um, can you give me the beat or something? Can you give me the beat, boys, or free my soul? Um, she, she texts these guys or, like, free me. I don't know. Like, she's just not happy where she's at. Um, somebody's sending, because they know your new love is coming in, they're sending bad vibes and energy to, because Spirit said, wait for new love. Okay? And I'm, I'll explain the, the cards as well, how it fell and stuff. So they know, so your exes or these women, they're sending bad energy to the new love, to you. They have um, sexually transmitted infection as well. I'm picking up chlamydia, I'm picking up uh, syphilis. Um, all right, huh? Hi, the door's open. So let's see. Ja, I'm on doing a video. Um, all right. So I asked for today's energy and it came up the six, the six of cups in reverse. And hi, baby. Yeah. Love your haircut. And, um, so it's saying beware warning. So it came in reverse. Oh, these traps and these lies and these st to, to stick, to lure somebody in, it didn't work, okay? So this is the web of lies here. It came in reverse. And the biblical scripture that came was, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean on, not unto your own understanding. In your ways, submit to him and he will make your path straight. Use discernment, test the spirit. And the thing is, this person didn't because it came in reverse, okay? This is Proverbs 3, 5 through 6. It came in reverse, okay? I said, use discernment and test the spirit. I wrote that on the bottom of it. And my ears is ringing right now, so that's confirmation. Um, yes, trust in the Lord with all of your heart and lean not unto your own understanding. This person um, was trying to do this, was trying to cause... And you know what I'm picking up with this too? With the Six of Cups in reverse? I'll tell you right now. All right, let's get this out of the way. All right, let's see. Gossiper, yes. They're very much gossiper and fake profiles I'm getting. Don't be looking at people you know, in so social media thinking that their lives are perfect because it's not. They all put up a show and then 30 seconds later, they're fighting, okay? So the Six of Cups, I'm, I'm sensing that 
they're having problems hold on guys i'm just trying to they're having problems with children trouble with children that could be um it could be a wide range of problems it might mean infertility miscarriages or a baby has passed on or other mar uh, marital uh, issues um it could mean the love and relationship is going bad um let's see reverse love like they thought they loved but it's because it's reversed it means that um some of the things are coming up to, to surface uh let's see their health and their life lifestyle is bad i can indicate severe illness when it comes in reverse as well so this this person can have all the problems that they wished on you i'm getting to their dog acts weird somebody's cat is attacking them like they really don't even want that cat around them they love the cat but they like i'm i'm get i'm seeing that they text someone can i go stay with you my cat is acting crazy like their animals are attacking them but this dog is acting very sexual towards somebody else i'm picking up okay so then this fell um this is the flame this is the devil wanted to cut cut you up in every you know cut your ways every way you you know they they wanted to backstab you thank you spirit um they they wish plagues on you they they get a um a laugh when they see people suffer they ruin they savor suffer and picking up they wanted to ruin you they wanted to ruin your life um they uh wow before oh my gosh before okay they wanted to see you suffer first and then slay you and then end your life okay they wanted to slay you and then end your life okay so what i got here is i got the two of pentacles in reverse so the two of pentacles in reverse can mean they're not organized nothing about their life is organized they have lack of organization Okay, a lot of this thing is impacting their lives with their children as well. Their 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 balance at work is not good. They they have no balance at work. I'm getting a Capricorn being fired. Um, let me see. And their job and their family, nothing is um, balanced out. Um, it could be somebody found out about a significant other, like a side chick. Maybe somebody thought they were the one, but they're not. Um, I'm, I don't know why I'm getting like a, a marriage, a wedding that tur turned into a dark turn. Like somebody showed up and was like, I'm the girl. What are you doing? Blah, 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 blah. And that woman set up a man because she found out. Um, this man could, or this woman could, um, I'm, I'm, I'm getting both, but I'm getting more woman. I'm getting the man was tired of being a player and, and wanted to settle down, but now it's too late. Because the, the cards flipped on them. You're not going to be treating everybody like bullshit and think you don't have to pay for it. Yeah, that's the law, okay? You, you Everything you do, you put out, you get in return, right? So this person, this woman and this man have major commitment issues. And uh, it's like they said, I'm, I'm picking up right now. Ah, she'll always be there. She'll always be there. She's weak. I'll just go to her and cry and she'll take me back. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. They didn't know you. They, they, they were treating your kindness as weakness, and the love that you had, they think they thought you didn't love yourself. The thing is, in the beginning, yeah, but now it's different. They didn't think you were gonna do all this healing and and found out about your self worth. But these mother freakers swear. They still had a chance with you. Even though you healed, even though you did this, I'm getting some of them cut you dry, cut you off, said, don't ever talk to me again. Um, they blocked you and now they're regretting it. Okay. And it's okay. Remember, these people act on impulse. They're very immature. They're bratty. They're the ones that their sisters or their mother gave them everything they, they wanted. Maybe their father was just like treating them like guard, like stop being a crybaby, go get another job. That's what I'm picking up too. Okay, so, and then I'm getting this per, this person is, po I keep wanting to say poison. Thank you, spirit. This 
person is poison. Um, this person's a serpent, okay? Um, a liar. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing like they go undetective. They're real sweet. They might smile. They might help people a lot. Um, they, if, okay, thank you, Spirit. If they had a chance to kill you without anybody finding out, I'm getting this person loves that movie. Um, where's the one that they played the siren and you had 24 hours to kill anybody that you wanted? Uh, the Purge. Thank you, Spirit. The Purge. And they would do it. That's why we are going to have four, four days of darkness where nothing works. No satellite, nothing. We're going to lose electricity. I'm going to tell you right now, move where somebody does not know you. Because if you have an alarm system, it's not going to work. Okay? I advise everyone to write down phone numbers and have a, a phone. A phone. Okay? But to have people's phone numbers on your hand, at hand, in a book. Stop going through cell phones like that shit is always going to be there. Okay? I'm telling you right now, people could play tricks on your phone. So don't don't play that. Stop telling people where you live. Stop letting your house be a house where everybody hangs out. Because I'm telling you, people's going through drawers. They're, they're, um, they want to put, uh, put drugs in your house. They want to put it in your car. They want to put cameras. I'm telling you, check your fire alarms as well. Check your car. Check the side of your car. They could be little cameras like this, little devices that they, keep, they can hear you. I'm also getting FBI outside of your house. Go through your Wi-Fi and check out because you will probably would see FBI listening to your conversation and checking out what you type in your um, your computer, um, everything. So, yeah. You already got caught. I'm hearing that they already did it and you got caught because you lied about somebody and then they found out that uh, it's not true. Uh, okay, look at that. And a car just started up outside the apartment right now. So this person right here is the king of cups. I'm getting Scorpio. You are going to cry. That's what I just heard. Um, this could be a Scorpio or a Pisces, the king of cups. It could be a woman or it could be a man. It does not matter. We can hold, embody and hold any of these energies. Okay. Any signs we can, we can, we can act as we're any signs like, I'm picking up so many people dealt with this motherfucker right here. I'm getting somebody stole money as well. If you are a Sagittarius, Capricorn, Taurus, Pisces, Aries, I'm getting that you dealt with this. This person right here it could be a Scorpio and this person could be a Pisces. I'm going to tell you right now. So Sagittarius, you need to tell your family how much you love them. I'm picking up Capricorn. You have been waking up because you saw a ghost. But not only that, you will see a ghost and you will wake up in a cold ass sweat. That's what I'm getting for some of you. Aries, um, something about sex, anal sex. Somebody's going to ask you for that. Um, Taurus, I'm getting someone too went and without permission just did that. Did something so disgusting and went and did that. And now they're apologizing for that. That's uncalled for. You never do that without permission. Yeah. Uh, Taurus, um, I think you, did you, are you applying for a college? Because the, the college that you wanted to go to, I'm hearing is going to accept you. Pisces, something happened to you that it's going to, that you're going to need, uh, plastic surgery, I think. Uh, or you're thinking about plastic surgery. Um, you will be a key witness at a trial. I'm hearing an important trial. Uh, Taurus, you were cheating, so that's good. You're gonna be caught out. Um, you're gonna be caught out, <laughs> you're gonna be found out, okay? All right, so the three cards that fell for that is may the God of hope fill you with joy and peace as you trust in Him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. I'm talking to a divine, a real divine master, a divine feminine here. 
May the Lord God fill you with all the joy. You dodged a gun, not a only a bullet. You dodged the whole entire gun. Okay. You learned your lesson and you let this person go. Okay. And the thing is why this person met somebody else is because the devil came and, and persuaded him and God allowed it. It all worked out for you. Do you understand? This person wanted to keep you because they thought you were stupid. Only towards the end, this person found out how stupid you weren't in, in the past. That you knew everything, okay? Um, I'm getting this, this, this person thought you were a witch, would call you a witch. and just, just because you were intuitive, because you had a gift. You were born psychic and you knew stuff. You just, you're not anybody's mother to be running around trying to figure out if they cheated or not, okay? Whoever pursues righteousness and love finds life and prosperity and honor, okay? I'm, I'm picking up heavy on a divine feminine that dodged these, this, this gun. One who has, un, now this is for this person. Could be a Scorpio, could be a Pisces, could be anyone, okay? That's in this manipulative, um, conniving, deceptive uh, way. Because King of Cups in reverse, that's what it is. They're very manipulative. They, they will cry and, and do pity potty party. That's what I call it. <laughs> so one who has unreliable friends soon comes to ruin. But there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. And that is God. And that's the one that God appointed you. That loved you for real. And helped you. And um, this is, uh, you know, this is for the this person. You now know that t t you, your friend was not there for you. And someone even told you. I heard someone told you that your friends are no good and you knew it and then you still stuck with you still stayed with them okay all right so all right so all of a sudden this came out someone wanted to backstab you it didn't work out it didn't happen and i'm getting somebody got backstabbed okay Somebody was planning on backstabbing you. It didn't work because they got backstabbed, okay? It came in reverse, okay? This person was hostile, deceptive. They were hiding their hands behind their back, all playing like they're your um, your hero. They wanted to, to do that, but this person could have been a good person in the past but became evil. This person wanted to be hostile towards you. They're hiding their identity. They were hiding who they truly were. I'm picking up with this. But this person was truly an enemy of you, okay? And someone else has is going to reveal this to you. Someone found out too, okay? They know that you are a strong ass B I T C H. okay? You're strong. You're loving, okay? You could be a Leo, you can have you could have a tiger that's living in you. <laughs> you could be a lioness, but be sweet at the same time. You can be stern and loving at the same time. Okay? And you are a sheep. You are a loving sheep. And the thing is there was a lot of wolves in the mist. Okay? But they know you're strong. You have a lot of strength. Okay? And you are love and you are going to get love because this card didn't belong in any of this. Okay, I just so happened to be guided to pick it up and it fell right here. I shuffled it and it landed right on the strength. You are love, you are going to have you are gonna find you are gonna find love. So I'm getting this king of wands. You need to um oh divine feminine, please do not be misled by this person. The angels are around you. Beware of your surroundings, though. Keep a lookout out the window and, you know, whatever that you have to, to protect yourself because God got the rest, okay? 444, four, four, you might see 100,000 angels surround you at all times, okay? You have a legion of them, all right? Um, okay, with this person right here, you need to pay attention and listen, okay? This could be for this uh, king, uh, this king of wands here. Pay attention and listen and, you know, whatever, how I'm reading it, just take it as a resonate. Like, you could flip it. It could be for the other person. It could be for you, okay? So pay attention and listen and the answer is no. Please do not be misled because God knows how 
um, you're very um, uh, empathetic. You're an empath, super empath for some of you. Um, you do uh, understand where they're coming from. You know why these people have done this stuff to you is because it was done to them and that's all they knew. And then they just found out that you are truly love, okay? You truly cared about them, okay? You nurtured them, you know, you did all that. So I'm getting that you, um, that God is forgiving. Okay, so yeah, thank you, Spirit. So Spirit said, read it just like how a divine feminine or divine masculine would do. So yes, you are forgiving, you're good, you're abounding in love and all who call to you, okay? And that's for God too. Everyone that um, you, Lord, is forgiving, just like you. Um, and God is good, you're good, abounding in love to all who call to you. So that is you, because um, God lives inside you. You, you an They called you, you answered the call, and now you're walking in God's path, the path that he had written for you. And I'm getting that, you know, we have to sacrifice. We have to sacrifice and... Um, just as Jesus sacrificed for us and Jesus went through hell. And if you guys see that movie, Mel Gibson made a good point of how God was beaten. You guys just read it. You guys just read it and that's it. But you all need to understand that Jesus got whooped in, 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 in every way with everything. Okay? And we need to sacrifice these people, I know it's going to be sad. I know that some of them are transforming, but some of them are not learning their lesson. It's like somebody gave them committee and they're like, oh, I forgive you. But come on, stop. I'm getting that movie. Thank you. With Ben Affleck. He just let her do whatever she wanted to do. Sleep with whoever she wanted to, do, to sleep with. But in this case, in real life, this woman came and brought a disease to him. Okay. I'm getting, damn, save some, um, told his friends, save some for me. Save some of her goods for me. And, you know, it's disgusting how they s spoke about this woman. You know, even if, this, you know, she is a prostitute, she's a call girl, but still, you know. Um, by wisdom, a house is built and through understanding, it is established. Um, through knowledge, its room are filled with, uh, with rare and beautiful treasures. Okay, so this person could have had nice things, could have had a nice house, but... Everything that went in that house was bad. Their children was bad. They weren't be dis they weren't being disciplined. They weren't being watched. They were doing whatever they wanted to do. So, you know, what is a beautiful house and with money, um, a good job and beautiful women and uh, what is all of that when nothing is going correct? What is that when you're putting your life? There's no one can your life is priceless. You can't you can't buy another life. Stop going to spiritual doctors for these second chances at life. They're not God. They're lying. Okay? They're lying. I'm getting sniff coke. These people sniff coke because my nose is itchy. Okay? All right. And then... Look at this. I didn't even I I didn't even read this. I didn't even read this. For some of you that is um wanting a change, it might be too late for the path with your divine person, but when you live in harmony with one another, you are not to be proud, but willing to associate with people that are in lower positions. Do not be conceited. These people did not. They walked, I'll never forget. This ex-friend of mine, I'll never forget that. Then I think that was so distasteful of him. I think that was the last time I've ever, ever, ever saw him after that. Like maybe years after, but just for a little bit. And it just ended up bad because this person's intentions wasn't to be friends. He wanted to be more than friends. And I didn't have those feelings for him. They were gone along. They were gone over a decade ago. So this person... It was so conceited it's because he had a good job, whatever, and he had a house or whatever. He would always talk down to the homeless. I'm getting some of them are homeless now. Um, they didn't talk with people in a low position. You know, if God made you a millionaire today, what are you going to do? You're going to remember those homeless people. You're going to try to help them. These people don't give a shit about third world country. They don't give a shit about shelters. They, um, they don't give a, a, a shit about homeless people in the street. 
They don't. They care about their money. They care about looking good. They care about how people look up to them. They, they want people, they think it's status. Oh, freak you and your money. <laughs> Please. Money is, money ain't shit if you're not gonna do right, if you're not gonna invest, if you're not gonna build, if you're not going to leave a legacy behind and in the right way. Give me one of those mini houses and I will live in it. I don't give a shit. I, I, I was telling my daughter if I ever won, I'm, squash that, when I win the lottery, <laughs> When I win the lottery or when God blesses me in any way he chooses, okay, I will get one of those beautiful, beautiful um, RVs that are the fully loaded and you can travel anywhere that you want, okay? That's what I would do. Freak the houses that could stay in one place. I mean, if I was to win a house right now, if I was to be given a house, I would cherish it. Don't give me wrong because having that stability over your head is beautiful. And then for your kids to live on after. But I mean, if I if I had so many houses, I would donate. I would donate for people that come out of jail for them to to um to have some support. Those that wanted to transform their lives, set them up because in society they set people up that come out of jail to go right back in. They don't give them a chance. Because you, your status, who you are, that brings people's spirit down. Just because you went to jail? No, you deserve a second chance. Cut the bullshit and let's go. It was 41.41 on the timer when I said that, 55. It's time to change. It's time to change your mindsets about money, about name bearing purses. Who cares? Who said that the, that person's name was, uh, you know, really big? Come on, get the cr Listen, Gucci is just as Gucci as you, okay? Beautiful, okay? You're Gucci, yes. You're Gucci like Gucci. You don't gotta go pay Gucci money to be showing people how beautiful and sexy, you know, you are. So G God demonstrates his own love for us in this way. While we were all still sinners, Christ died for us. You guys still don't get it. You guys will always say, oh, God killed his son. You're such an idiot for that. God killed his son. So he's going to kill you. He doesn't give a shit about you if he killed his own son. Cut the bullshit. Jesus came down to do one thing. He was to teach us and leave a legacy behind. Without that Bible, we would be living life blindsided. It's to teach us Jesus's way but to connect with God and the ascending masters which Jesus is an ascending master he came down in human form he died he's a he's an ascending master Mary's an ascending master now let me tell you something God lives in within us all of us even when we're sinning that's why sometimes we have that good inner voice that if somebody was to just if you were just to go and charge at somebody there's somebody that can be the peacemaker. You see you calm down and you start listening to reason. Like, you know what? That's true. I'll never forget when those 20 kids were shot up, people all was blaming God. So people were in a crowd and they were talking junk about God. Oh, God's not real. He wouldn't, he could have came up and did this. Sweetie, it's not time for God to come down. He got killed. He was, you know, swept out. He's not here. The serpent, Lucifer, was casted down on earth. He's no longer supposed to be in heaven. So Lucifer's like, yeah, you don't want me? You're casting me out? I'm going to take all your children with me. He's down here causing ruckus. Why are you guys letting Satan off the hook and letting him he, 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 with your stupid ass right behind you? Because he got you right where you want. You ain't no good to be blaming God. Who the hell do you think you are? Do you, don't, do you not believe there's Satan? That Satan does all that? So there was two people that came towards me in different occasions. I wasn't there, but two people came accordingly to that meeting. And they were talking shit about the other person. I said, no. I mean, I understand where you were coming from, but is it the right, the right thing to say? Where there is God, there is, you know, evil. Then the other person was like sticking up for God. 
but cussing her out, calling her the devil and all that, you just lost God. You were supposed to teach her in a correct way. God doesn't need your help. He doesn't need you to stick up for him. We need God. We need each other. We need to, to teach other people in the right way. You don't pull somebody's um, character down to, to put God, God up there. God's already up there. He's always going to be a winner. <laughs> always. He's always a winner. The minute you give it to God, he won. So he doesn't need us. We need him. So we need to represent him in a right way. We don't represent him in an evil way. We don't cuss people out and throw people under the rug to speak for God. The bird just confirmed it for me. <laughs> All right. Now, this is for this one. Thank you, Spirit. All right. Let's get this out of the way. Because things are about to get deep and some people ain't going to lock it. <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> all right so oh hold on here what wow something just happened some of you are getting brain fogged like having confusion and forgot some stuff. All right, this and okay. Spirit wanted me to take that out. All right, so with this King of Wands here, this person wanted you to chase them, to call them. They were, they were uh, summoning you. That's what I'm getting. This person had a lot of roller coaster crap in their life. Okay. It could be these people, okay? Um, I'm hearing the player got played. They try to play you because I'm hearing somebody saying, oh, you want to play? I love games. Let's play. Bitch, whatever you done in the past shall not come in this century, okay? Not in this <laughs> lifetime, all right? I'm getting a witch doctor again, and I'm getting your ex. I'm getting... Um, African descent, Nigeria. Um, I'm getting all, yeah, I'm getting Haitian, Haiti too, DR or whatever. Um, this person here, King of Cups, did not get a divorce. This could be, this even could be an Aquarius or they got married with an Aquarius. I don't know. But they didn't get a divorce and they always thought this bitch will always be there. I'll always go and get this bitch back. That's what you think, punk. That's what you think, okay? Because I'm picking up no divine feminine or divine masculine wants your ass back, okay? Because of everything you were exposed to, everything you were exposed to, okay? I'm getting someone didn't even want their kid baptized because they're like, baptism is fake and all that. But I'm here to tell you that it's... When you're baptized, it means you're being washed with water to show repentance, forgiveness, and uh, faith in Jesus, okay? If you read Galatians 3, 2, 7, or Romans 6, 4, you will see that, okay? Um, all right. Thank you, Spirit, for that. Okay. Jail. And some people that were evils turning good. Some people that was uh, good turned into ev evil. There was an imbalance, an unbalanced people, okay? This right here, this, you could be a Libra, okay? The scale is not balanced here, okay? It's not. So guess what? These people are looking to go to jail. For some reason, too, I'm getting, like, underground. I don't know why, like, this... This place is hidden, like in a forest. It's like a nice castle looking, like a huge house. I'm, I'm getting somebody just could be from Africa and be a real king. Uh, but, but I'm, I, and then for some, I'm getting it's jail. I'm getting jail. Somebody's going to jail. That's what I'm getting. Thank you. There's been a lot of tower moments as well.
Mm. Yeah, jail. And this is the card for you, the, the one that's going to jail. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does not, who does the will of my father who is in heaven. Did you hear what Jesus said? You weren't, you didn't do the will of your father. You did something that you need to pay for and they're going to jail. Somebody even got set up, but I'm telling you by a woman, you got, we're getting married and some woman tried to say, I, I don't know, Aquarius, your wedding must have took a, a dark turn. That's what I'm hearing right now. And for those that tried to mess up their life. Oh, thank you, pumpkin. No, 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 it's from Milan. Oh, from Milan. Okay, okay, I'll give it to them. Um, for those that tried to hurt you, tried to cause you harm, it's not going to happen because, listen, first of all, your love. And not only that, you had a legion of soldiers that God sent forth. And I called my legions to pin every witch doctor. You're done. You're done, sucker. I saw you. I saw you in my download. You couldn't believe what was happening to me. You just couldn't. You saw how protected I am. You know, you know. You know divine feminines are the real deal. You know divine masculines are the real deal. Okay? If you escaped something divine masculine and you turned karmic... You best to know your queen did that, okay? Your princess, your angel on earth, that's what I'm hearing. Because they loved you no matter what, because they knew there was a command of God, but not only that, is God was living inside of them. God lives inside you, you're always going to have that love, okay? God, this person, divine feminine or divine masculine, was sending out love and they knew that you were doing these rituals. They knew. You thought they were stupid. Yeah. Yeah. They have uh, soldiers of angels. Legions of soldiers out. And to any choice. It could be wolves. I think some of you got attacked by wolves. You saw wolves. In the, and I'm telling you, there's a building that people go and they hide. It's like in a forest hiding. It's hiding from society. And somebody got attacked by a wolf. Thank you, spirit. All right, now is the beautiful thing. Wait for new love. These people are going to come back. You're going to feel sorry for them. You, you know, they were misguided. They were misguided. But if they were misguided, where are they? Where are they? They had enough time. They have ample time to come to you. And the reason why they had to come to you is because they lived in ego all of their lives. And they were doing some, they were doing summoning magic to manifest you back. That's ego. That's not love. Love is like, yo, spirit, tell me right now, this is your person. You have the leeway. Yo, I'm taking a plane, a train. I ride a bike. I'll take a boat. I'm going to get to my baby. I'm going to go claim my baby. That's how I feel. Don't be summoning me to be calling you. Because I hear chanting over and over and over. The name, chanting, chanting. That's not going to do anything. I'm just going to laugh in your face and be like, you know what? Enough's enough. I've, 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 got, I've got enough of it. It's done. Close it out. The cycle's closed. It's an ending. If... I, if it, you know, if it was up to me, I would, I, I don't care. Don't come, don't come back. The spirit is like, some of them want to close out a cycle and a, good. I'll close it out. But remember, we don't need to reconcile to these people. We don't need to accept them back in our lives. Some of them cannot be accepted back because they cannot uh, enjoy the fruit that God has in store for you. Okay. Now, wait for new love. You have an emperor. <laughs> Okay, I'm not going to say anything about it could be a Sagittarius Leo or an Aries, but I'm not going to say that because this person could be a water sign. It could, they could be an air sign, but they're sitting pretty. They're sitting rich. They're sitting like a king, like the man they are, the protector they are. They are manifesting you or you're manifesting them. This doesn't necessarily have to mean magic. It didn't come in reverse. But this person is manifesting you. You guys are manifesting each other, I'm hearing. Okay? This person right here will do everything and anything for you. It could even be a Taurus. Look, I'm telling you. 
any of these men could be any sign. I don't believe in all that. It's the energy. It's the element. For me, it's the element. Water, fire, um, air. It could be the element. Air cuts through the bullshit. They cut through the lies. And that's, you know, air signs do that. But you don't have to. Like I said, I hold a lot of Virgo. I, I love to be in hermit mode all the time. I'm not. I'm an Aquarius. You believe that Aquariuses love to socialize. They love to do. I don't like that. I like to be alone. I like I like solitude. I like peace. Okay. Give me the beach anytime. I don't need party. I don't need people to look at me and be like, um, and, and, and have attention. I don't need that. I don't. I don't need no fake ass attention. I don't need guys looking at my, my ass or my titties and shit or my, you know, or any of that. I don't need that. Wherever you go and you find these people, that's who they are. <laughs> 55, 55 on the timer. All right. So they're manifesting life with you. Love. The 10 of pentacles is everything. It's the ultimate everything. And guess what? You're going to have it because your whole entire family, even your fake ass foes, your friend, your, the ones that you thought was your friends wasn't. They kept doing this. They kept wanting you to meet molesters, rapers, woman beaters all of your life. Okay. And that's exactly who they ended up with. A pedophile, a rapist, a murderer. Nine of Cups, you're going, you are the Nine of Cups. Look, you got the Nine of Cups all by yourself. Remember I kept telling you I see gold? I wanted gold to be in my house all day. And that's, I'm telling you, I wanted gold furniture. I was thinking about spraying my furniture gold. It's it's just amazing. Like the gold that I kept seeing, and you know? Because we go through different times. Like I wanted my house to be like, looking like earth and having plants all over. And now it's like, I want gold now. I want gold. You deserve the gold that's coming to you. You, had the, you got this all by yourself, the nine of cups. If you did it, listen, when, when readers give you this message, stop saying, oh, it's not me. That's not me, honey. It doesn't, this is, could be for the future. This could be coming now. You know what you're supposed to be feeling rich anyway, already. Rich of love, rich of everything. You should be lacking nothing. You should be just complete. Somebody's coming in to compliment you. Thank you, spirit, all right? They see you as loyal. You're loyal and you're loving. Till this day, you didn't get up under another woman or a man. Somebody tested you online as well. I'm hearing like they'll come on and say, Oh, there's nothing like getting up on an, another another man or another woman. No, bitch, there is. Yeah, it's called stay by yourself and heal. Stop bringing your 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 bullshit to other people and to other relationships. Stop stop controlling a man and stop thinking you can buy them a car or buy them jewelry or buy them clothes to keep them. No man, you can't you can't manipulate a man's heart. You can manipulate their mind, but you can't manipulate their heart. Who wants a woman or a man that buys other people? Buys other people's love? No. They should be loving you for you. You're real. I'm hearing you're real. You're the real deal, okay? You you cut away the, the bullshit or they have... The, the, this, um, this emperor here, they cut the bullshit. See? They cut all the bullshit, all the bullshit out. All right, they cut away and now they have truth and now they have a solution. Okay. This could be something that's going to happen within the next year. Okay. You might come. This person probably needs to heal a lot. I don't know why it just. Yeah. Thank you, spirit. Look at this. They want the two of cups with you. This person had a death and rebirth. It could be something that caused them to have in their experience death, like an accident or something, okay? A new beginning at passion and again, gold. Victory. They have a lot of passion for you, all right? They see you like this playful too, I'm picking up, okay? A new beginning. Look at this, again, clarity, the third eye. Many of you need to go meditate on this camp. I'm getting, go meditate on um, 
this cancer maybe that's coming. Listen, I got, I'm going to tell you about my download. It wasn't good. You know, it wasn't good at all. It's like somebody wants to tell you something, like a mother wants to call you and tell you that somebody passed away and they're not telling you. They keep beating around the bush and you're like, tell me, just tell me already. I keep hearing that. Look, the sun, another gold. You see that? I can't make this up. Look at this. This is all happiness. This is death, rebirth. This is two of cups. And then look at these, these cards. You can't go wrong. Look at this. Wait for new love because spirit has all of this. Keep manifesting your emperor. Okay, divine feminine and divine masculine. They're manifesting you as well. It's not about the money. You might have money, but you're going to see that this person cares about children. This person cares about family values. They don't care about anything. They care about love. They care about kids' well-being. They care about a man's well-being. But, I, but I'm getting that it's time for this Cinderella to be, or Bella, from Be your name could be Bella, or it could be from Beauty and the Beast. It's time. It's time. Okay, we're going in an hour here. I'm just going to hurry up. And um, this was a lot of control. This is freak. I'm hearing freak. These people are freaks. They're controlling. They have. They do bad blood magic here. I'm getting mental unwellness, wounded, impulsive action, distorted energy. I'm getting that from this. Um, I'm getting it from the Knight of Wands is like that. Okay, I'm getting that from the Knight of Wands. All right, um, and the answer is no. Do not be misled with this manipulative um, water sign here that can reverse. Do not be manipulated and misled. And the answer is no for this Knight of Wands. Okay, um, this call girl can have a lot of boys, um, could have a lot of guy friends, um, a lot of buddies she text. Um, I'm getting that some people are going to start texting you when you, you've reached and you've won and you're sitting up there pretty and you're just going to be like, you know what? Nice try, buddy. You should have been nicer to me in the past. I'm getting that a lot for a lot of people or maybe your text has said that. I'm getting that, um, uh, I'm getting that a phone company texts someone and saying, you need, you need not to conversate. Something was what happened. Maybe a kid did a video or there was a conversation that was very, very bad in Verizon or I don't know why I just said that, but Verizon, T-Mobile, one of those, they, they, they will look at your content and they will, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm hearing that someone said something to a phone company and they were like, they're going to disconnect you or something like that. Or, um, they, the, the conversation or the video or whatever that that was seen, they sent it off to FBI or cops. Um, somebody's saying, dude, you need to see a professional or seek professional help. Um, something about, I was going to, I was going to, no, somebody text someone else and like, you know what? You have a small D, get a donut and put your thing in the donut and get my drip. Oh my gosh. Like somebody's, Somebody's wiener is just small, but they have um, this energy, this se sexual energy, like they, you know, whatever they call that thing, B BD energy or something, but this thing is real small. And somebody said, put it to a, a donut. <laughs> you guys are crazy. Um, somebody's like, I'm still not over you. I'm crying after... We had sex. I don't know. Something like that. Um, someone's so desperate. They're taking numbers off 7-Eleven or playing games. I don't know about 7-Eleven or having a bad stomach or going to the bathroom. Um, somebody read something out loud from a phone. Embarrassing somebody or saying, I want to die right now. Maybe a teacher. Um... Somebody was, I don't know, waiting for someone to notice something. Um, somebody wish you were there so they could whisk, they could talk to you or whisper. I don't, 
something about air whisper or do you hear someone whispering in your ears a divine masculine like i love you um wherever you are just remember i love you like somebody's sending you messages i'm getting wow somebody's getting flash flashbacks and getting a, a boner i'm getting um someone tried to get a job like at google or another company but they dropped out of high school or something like that i don't get it like they they're trying to get a job at google at whatever but they dropped out they don't have a, a high school diploma um yeah somebody gave somebody is like as much as i like talking to you you gave me chlamydia so bye don't call me again or something like that. Uh, somebody's telling one girl, I want to use you to come to dinner and piss my dad off. So in all actuality, this this guy or this woman is saying that you're no good and you look like a slut. They just want you to, you know, they just want you to make their father mad. Uh, fly monkey shit. They probably said, yeah. Um, somebody just cares about what their mother thinks about them. If their mother thinks that they're handsome. If their mother thinks that, that that's good enough for them, I'm done. Um, somebody's neighbor keeps complaining about your music being too loud. You probably have too much rap all the time. It's too loud. Maybe you play Drake all the time or maybe you beat um, Little Wayne or something like that. Um, yeah, somebody's father keeps calling them crybaby, like shut the F up, go get another job. They got fired. It could be a Capricorn that acts immature. Um, some guy is watching Brokeback Mountain. Um, he's probably gay. He just got caught watching it. Or um, I'm hearing somebody saying, so uh, here's the thing. The answer is no. Spirit said correct. Say peace. Um, somebody, yeah, somebody wants to crash in somebody else's house because their animals attacking them. Their cat could be acting like a wolf or there's a real wolf that attacked someone's face. Uh, something about farting. Somebody went on a date and was like, you know what? Lose my number. I know it was you that kept farting. Somebody ate peanuts or sesame seeds or something before a date or... Um, I don't know. Somebody keeps saying, listen, there's a pervert uncle here. I keep, keep saying, uncle, uncle, come on. I'm, I'm, I'm rocking around with my uncle or something like that. I don't know. There's some uncle that's weird. Um, yeah, somebody farted on their date and was like, look, I like, I like the date and everything, but I know it was you. That was disgusting. <laughs> somebody has a goatee. And when they comb it, they think they're the shit. Somebody is, maybe you're the one that's supposed to get married or whatever. I don't know. Somebody threw a tuxedo on or a tuxedo shirt um, and trimmed their goatee or I don't know. Maybe they cut off their goatee, but they think they're the shit. And somebody that thinks they're the shit and they have their goatee, they act like an asshole. Or somebody said, you think you're perfect because you got that goatee or something like that. Um, somebody is like, you know what? Your wife don't let you do nothing. Let me tell you something. If somebody's married, leave them the hell alone. You guys are always meddling, trying to pin somebody. Like your wife is not letting you off the leash. You can't be. You can't hang around with the boys anymore. Your wife won't let you. Like grow the fudge up. Um. I just heard. Oh my God! Thank God I got my period. I really did not want to have a kid with you. That's cold. Sorry, I have a boyfriend. Somebody try to get with somebody and they're like, they have a boyfriend or whatever. Um, somebody lives and breathes off the horoscope. And somebody's like, you know what? Screw you in your horoscope, in your sign bullshit. Stop blaming all that horoscope shit. On, you know, like I keep hearing that as well. Somebody went bankrupt and they just can't believe it. Like they're talking to somebody about bankrupt. Their business went bankrupt. Um, or somebody saying it was good times or the, they were bankrupt for a year, maybe. Um, yeah, somebody's telling them to put their private in, in the donut hole. 
<laughs> They're trying to prove a point. They <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. You guys need to stop. Love is what matters. <laughs> Somebody's having a movie night. They always have movie night. They always, yeah, they always talk about the leash and yeah. Somebody's mother called them. Somebody's mother said something. Maybe cussed you out, called you a bitch. Or I don't know, maybe an Aries here. You never thought your mom would would tell you something like that or something like that. Um, somebody got chubby or whatever. They call them Teletubby or they dressed up as Teletubby or something for pleasure. I don't know. <laughs> somebody gained weight or maybe look like a Teletubby. Um... Somebody's mother keeps sending them texts. They be in the same house, and they the mother instead of talking to them, they send them texts. So it's like, can you please stop doing that or whatever? I don't know. I'm really, I'm hearing. I'm really sorry about. Oh my gosh, yeah. I'm sorry. I accidentally put it in your, you know, the backside of your body. Somebody's um, paranoid about that. How you feel, and you were pissed. You probably punched this person. Uh. Somebody, instead of somebody selling weed, they were putting, <laughs> they were putting fake stuff in there. You guys better be careful. They were putting fake shit, like mixing oregano, maybe with other poisonous stuff or put, putting bombing fluid. I don't know. I'm hearing all kinds of stuff. I'm picking up on a really jealous fire sign here. Woman, Leo, Aries, Sag. Um, I'm hearing, I never felt this kind of love before. This could even be to a divine feminine. Like, this is weird. Um, they're receiving all your ba all their bad karma. This could be a knight of wands. Like, this person didn't feel this type of way for you. This could be a woman that didn't think they were going to fall in love with you, but they did. But you you were like, hell no. Um, they're crying for you. Um, somebody was misguided. Or this fire sign woman was misguided. Or this knight of wands was misguided. But I'm getting this Aquarius. If you're going to get married, that wedding is going to turn into a dark. It's going to be a dark turn with that with that wedding. Um, Libra, you're going to find a new best friend. Pisces, you are a very ugly person. Spirit said, because of that, you're going to find someone that's uglier than you. Um, Gemini, something about you're going to shit your pants. You're going to get severe heartburn. Something's coming come to light. Scorpio, you will cry. You ex expect it. Aries, I think it's something you're going to hit the jackpot or a large sum of money you're going to win. Um, Pisces, you will lose your sex appeal. Um, something about adopting a family, I mean, a pet into your family, Taurus. I don't even know why you get that, but. Uh, yeah, Aries, your mom's going to call you a stupid bitch. <laughs> Um, something about an Aquarius, you're going to meet Oprah and somebody's going to ask you for your autograph and Virgo, your friends are going to start group chatting without your ass. Leo, you're going to be caught, you know what, doing what? You have a problem with masturbation and Aries, you will never experience pure happiness in your life. That's what I'm hearing. Um... I'm also picking up moving overseas, no help given to you. It could be a, wo a really a woman that's hating. She's a, wo a hating ass bitch, I'm hearing. She's so jealous of your connection. Um, you are the father. The DNA result says you're the fa father here. All right, so let's get some of this message here and then close it out. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. Beware of your surroundings. You're going to win. You're going to win. Beware of your surrounding. Give a person a chance to talk. Holy Spirit. There could be more than one Aries, I heard. Or fire sign. Yeah. There's one Aries that's going to be good. Thank you, Spirit. 
There's one Aries that's going, there's an Aries, okay, is it a woman Aries or what's the woman? A woman Leo. A woman Leo. Awful. Uh, you're getting a lot of karma. What about the the guy? What about the guy? Something about indigo, crystal, rainbow. Energy cleansing. You guys need, and the guy maybe need energy. Aries. Aries guy. Something's been highlighted. There's 444 here. You're an angel on earth. You dealt with an angel on earth, I heard. The answer is yes. What else? Don't stop. Keep moving, though. Don't stop. Keep moving. Anything else? I'm getting a lot of traveling, too. Like, you guys are going to think twice about taking anybody from your past back. And this is your beautiful. Thank you, spirit. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Um, all right. Okay. I heard throw one handful of... of Holy Spirit, one handful of cubic, cubitos, cubit. Oh, I saw a shard glass. Somebody wants to stab somebody. Yes, <laughs> fell on the floor, yes. So if it, it comes to your door, all right, yes. What's this? Yeah, Taurus wants to come. All right, so... Yes, liar wants to use you. Okay. Holy Spirit, holy angels. It's a kill plot, but there's angels around you. Everything you have will disintegrate, guys. The one that plotted Q and N. Control freak. I'm hearing the letter, the letters Q and N. Control, freak, blood magic, mental unwellness. Okay, a girl. A girl needs to be aware of their surrounding. Okay. Jail. Two, two, two. Somebody's trying to do a... Somebody... Somebody... A liar's going to jail. Somebody wants to use... If you... Like me, I have two, two, two at the end of my name. There's cops. There's cops involved, so you're okay. Okay, I'm hearing there's there's a change. Five five five. Yeah, kill plot. The one that did the plot to, to kill you is everything's going to disintegrate for them. Okay, everything. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yes. You can talk. Do not kiss. Someone's far. The letter G. Okay, the letter G is far away. I'm hearing. Holy Spirit, only angels are they will be. M, completion, 10. Be aware of your surroundings. You're out of jail. You could be a lawyer. Okay? And you got completion, number 10, M. Letter M. Yes, you're going to travel. Far. Yes, far. Travel. G. You might. Yeah, someone's a bad lady and someone's a good lady. Okay. Beware. Um, okay. Holy Spirit. Holy. Anything else? Yes. You're an angel. They try to poison an angel. Okay. They they put a poison in your in in the drink. They wanted to do that. Somebody will call you and tell you this. Um, they can have a red car or a black car. Somebody with a red car, I'm getting. And somebody has a black car. Okay. Um, Divine Diva 222, thank you. I hope I've inspired you. I hope I've given you some clarity. The messages come from light. It comes from, from spirit. And you know what? You need to meditate and pray. With this message that I gave you, Please use discernment because I got something about somebody's back teeth, their molar. This is a piece of rock that when I was sweeping just kind of made a noise, you know. And they look like molars. So somebody's molars are coming off in the back of their mouth. Somebody got punched. I'm getting two. And somebody lost the back of their, uh, it could be a um, bad lady that's losing the back of their teeth. 
You're very bad, a bad person I'm getting, okay? Um, and then this is not real glass. This though has been showing up in my pictures. I have pictures that this sign is near me. And the thing is, they wanted you to get stabbed. This was from a painting I had to cut off. And it, and it, you know, it formed on the edge of the painting. So somebody wants to cut you, okay? Someone wants to cut you, it has something to do with blood. They're sick people, I'm telling you. There's some sick people. These, these ritualists and these people that are out of the country, I love my culture. Let me tell you, because I'm from, West, you know, my parents are from West Coast of Africa. I have it in my blood, even though I was born in America, but still, you know, I have that in my blood from the West Coast of Africa, so... Yeah, this, yeah, thank you, Spirit, for for, for um, telling me this. So, yeah, that could be a sign for you, okay? So, I wish you all the blessings. Remember, you're protected. Please focus on God. Focus on God. Focus on God. Keep moving. Keep moving. Don't stop, okay? I love you. I'm Divine Diva 222. Have a good night, and don't let anyone dim your light. Peace. Bye.